Good morning and welcome back to the heart of England Way. Now that is the Swan Pub. We're in the village of Whitaker Heath. I think I've said that right. Uh, following the heart of England Way. Now I made the mistake last time of uh, walking to the village and then when I got home I realised we should have turned off just before the village. So I've parked the car at Shustoke Reservoir this morning and made my way along the roads to here. Now we're going to continue from where I got to last time, backtrack a little and see if we can find where I should have turned off at the heart of England Way. Oh, watch the trees there. So let's continue our walk, if I can find it, on the heart of England Way. Okay, so just before the railway bridge, if you're following the heart of England Way, there's a small turn in, it looks like a driveway, to a couple of bungalows, that's where we should have turned. Just had a quick look, and there are, there are some signs there, but that was covered up by a path closure. So, here we go. We are now back on the heart of England Way. Let's continue and put a bit of music and stuff over this, and let's have a walk, come on.
Well, this is a long straight path. We've got the railway to our left and to the right, just beyond the trees and down the bank, is the River Bourne. And beyond that is Shustoke Reservoir, which we can't see through the trees. And that's where we're heading next. According to my map, I was going to head back towards uh, Shusto Reservoir, but the signs tell me to do a left up the side of this field. So we'll follow the signs. It's unfortunate, really, that the uh, Heart of England Way takes you around the reservoir, but it doesn't take you anywhere near the reservoir, to be fair. You don't really see it with the trees. Luckily, I took a few shots this morning uh, when I parked the car there. So here's a look at Shustoke Reservoir, even though if you are walking the Heart of England way, you don't really see it much. Shame that.
well what a lovely walk so far I did get lost in a couple of the fields earlier on as I either missed the signs or there was missing but luckily for you you don't have this problem if you're walking the sections that I've walked because if you log on to Webby's Walks at www.webbyswalks.co.uk click on Heart of England Way section you'll get a map of the sections that I've walked so far and if you click the full screen in the corner you get said map you can zoom in you can see where you are see if you're on the right track well that's if I've done it right webiswalks.co.uk not your average walking website that was my go at doing an ad
Okay, so I'm lost now. We started at the very far end of that field, and the signs were pointing in the field in a sort of straight line, but there was no cut through through the crop, so I sort of walked around the edge of the field. Then I thought I was in the wrong field, so I scrambled down a bank over a brook into the next field, realised I was then in the wrong field, so I scrambled back. And I've followed the edge of the field and I've seen no signs on no way off to the corner. So we're just going to head in a little bit more to see if there should have been a path through the middle of the field to bring us out over here. It's all good fun on the heart of England way. Okay, not far from the corner of the field where I was just uh, speaking over there. It looks like there is a path through the uh, crops there, which I didn't see. And we found our way. Happy days. An example of what keeps happening. I've just walked through this field from there to here, realised there's no way out. Look back at the map, I've gone the wrong way, I should have gone up that field. I've been doing that a lot. I think part of it's me tired, the signposting's not that good. The map that I've done in preparation <laughs> it's not that good. So, all in all, uh, who, who do we blame? I think we blame me. <laughs> Uh, for this, but it does get tiring when you keep doing it. It's about the third field now. There are though. I've just walked that way, come through this field, and I've headed down there to that dead end. But according to the map, that's the way I'm supposed to be going. Now there's no sign, it's just no. There's nothing to say. Turn. I'm supposed to climb the gate. <sighs> very, very, very. Okay, so it's one and a half fields wrong. That's where I was just standing, at that little hedgerow there. I've backtracked a little and found this little gap. I mean there was no sign earlier on. I can see a sign there so straight on. <sighs> yes, we're back. We're back on it.
okay and we're nearly at the end now I'm very close to the M6 oh my god he's very in inquisitive okay there I'm probably not wearing the best colour top <laughs> yeah I'm just uh, passing through here no I mean you no harm this isn't very scary that's it that's it you were uh, nice cows oh Christ you would have to oh that's it that's it you keep moving I'll go this way oh, it's absolutely surrounded by them they're uh, it's alright I'm using the camera just to have a look how close he's getting I can see him following me there oh safety I'm not going to lie, I was a little bit scared then. <laughs> Made it to the M6 motorway bridge. That's as far as we're going to do today. Uh, try and get back here on another session. Just got to walk back through them cows now. The car's parked at uh, Shustoke Reservoir, so I think about two hours, two and a half hours. I'm not sure how long to get back. Might probably be quicker because I took, I took that many wrong turns coming here. So thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe and all that stuff and uh, hope to see you again soon in one of my other walking videos. Ta-ra for now! Good morning, welcome back to the Heart of England Way. What's the name of that pub before we move on? Heart of England Way. Part. Oh, I've got, I've got, parts. Parts. 